special guest on the channel and it's Maggie, my other roommate. And today we did a uh, get ready with me while like getting to know my roomie kind of thing. Cause uh, we kind of left you out when- It's fine. Yeah, it was just like, you know, circumstantial. Yeah. Oh I no, don't know situational. Where I was. Situational. Where was I? I don't even know. Whatever, Anyways. but <laughs> we're here now, and if you'd like to get to know her and see how these looks turned out, keep watching. Okay, so I don't really believe in primer. I don't know about you. Do you believe in primer? Um, I I usually use a primer, but that's just because I feel like my pores are so bad. So I'm using like Le Mer moisturizer, and then I'm gonna use a primer and try it out. But you didn't believe in primer. But like, I'm just trying it. She's you know? trying. It. Like, yeah, she's testing the water. You know, like religious. You know, like you always kind of have to like be rebellious to like understand yeah. God and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh God. I have. We're just gonna say the weirdest stuff on here because one we, finals and two it's us. Yeah. That, that's real. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna take about one squirt. I do about um a glob. A glob. A glob of my foundation. Can you see it? You know how people are like. Yeah, but it's your own arm. Just be like, hey, you know? Oh, shoot, I lost my blunt blooper, blooper, blooper thing. <laughs> your beauty blender? Oh, it's over here. We're getting ready. Bam, 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 bam. And it's so energetic. That's what you like about me. Exactly. You're a ball of fresh air. Um, we're gonna use two globs of this new Chanel. You have to tell them what you're doing. I'm putting on my foundation with this Fenty Beauty brush. Oh, is it the the foundation brush? Yeah. I don't hear oh, that's so good. I like it. Oh, you don't? No, I lost my beauty blender and got this like silicone one, but I don't like that either. So I'm stuck with this one. What? No offense. I heard Jeffrey Jeffrey Star like really liked it. Mm, I don't know. Maybe it's just like I don't like my foundation, and it, I just don't like the way that it goes on, but. Aww. Yeah, I just feel like it doesn't always blend very well, you know? So you want a beauty blender? Oh yeah, I miss it so bad. I threw one of mine away I've had like since beauty blenders like got popular. Oh yeah. Like I feel bad I had it. I threw it away like yesterday. <laughs> I feel like that's how like, all my makeup is. I'm like, I really oh, honestly... Sir. No! You, you really I honestly say what? Um, I really like, that's how I am with all of my makeup. I like have it for so long. I'm like, I really should throw this away, but I don't. Well, I feel like eyeshadow, if you don't use it all the time, then it's like not, like, mm -hmm. what's the harm in it, you know? But whatever. So how are your finals going? Um, honestly, not too bad. There's always room, I believe, for improvement, but at this point in my life, I don't care. Yeah. I feel like we're just like, yay, we passed, you know? You know, yeah. I'll know my grades when I get them back. And so now I'm putting on concealer oh yeah i'm using um this new dior skin forever what are you using um i think it's covergirl like they're clean oh, yeah. stuff covergirl did you know that's the biggest makeup company i'm not surprised don't surprise me but no i did not know that just like well i was watching ellen and if she said it then well ellen is a one of the covergirl fans what? Is yeah, she, she really? Yeah, you didn't know that. I, mean, I, I, I forgot. Oh god, I feel embarrassed. <laughs> I just forgot. Like, I haven't seen that ad in a while. Uh-huh. So... I almost was like, wait, is she all May or is she cover girl? But she's definitely cover girl because she did that, like, the ageless one. Yeah. She's... She really is ageless. But... Oh, for sure. I, I want to know what her skincare routine is. I don't know. I don't feel like she would use Botox, so it uh -uh. probably isn't that. I have to say something, I forgot. You asked me for a fortune cookie. Oh yeah. And they were closed. What, so, okay, is that why you didn't go? And yeah, then you got burger yeah, for yeah. they closed? Could you tell that that happened to me? Oh, because you said you're 99% burger fi. Yes. I was like, oh no, she's gonna hate me. Oh no. So we're moving out, if you can't tell by the tomorrow. background. Yeah, we're both moving out tomorrow. It's our last exam. Yeah, this is my last night sleeping in the house until next semester. Might be my last time forever. I know, it's sad. I don't want to talk about it. It's been a fun ride. Why are you all the way back there? I don't I'm not. Like... I'm like literally standing beside of you. So you just stepped up. <laughs> <laughs> I'm using the Anas Anas Anastasia. Is that what Anastasia? Anastasia. I would say Anastasia because we're in the south, but. 
Well, Anastasia, wasn't that a movie? Yeah, I loved that movie. It's a good one. Yeah, I actually cried. I don't know why. So she's using pomade, and I'm using Duo Matte Makeup Forever Powder. Um, but yeah, so like living in the house together, I feel like Claire's like never here, so we got closer towards the end of the semester, mm -hmm. you know? And like we're both like super weird. I feel like. Like, we all are super weird. Like, we all, like, really go together, I feel like. I feel like we all have super different personalities, but somehow they all complement each other. How are we different? How are me and you different? Yeah, like, how are we all different? Um, okay, well, I feel like you're on one side of the spectrum, and then Claire's on the complete opposite. And then I kind mean? of, it, like, I'm in, like, the middle. Okay, like, specify. Like, okay, so, like, your, like, sense of humor is super goofy, and like super like you'll just like laugh at everything because yeah. I mean, like everything's funny especially when it's with you oh and she's like sarcastic yeah and she's like sarcastic kind of has like a little english has like a dry sense of humor and then i'm kind of like in the middle of like you're of dry those. and you laugh at everything yeah so i also just did another powder he just double snapped a guy to be na not named we'll call him voldemort yeah I was gonna promote us. Are you really? Yeah. Well, there's this guy. Uh, can we not put this part in the video? Oh, really? You don't wanna talk about it? No. Because he will for sure know, and then that'll just be. Is he gonna watch it, you think? I see, that's the thing I don't know. Well, I like to imagine everything I do, like every guy I talk to at the time sees everything. Yeah. You know, like if I tweet something that's like emotional, I hope he thinks. She needs this kind of guy. She likes this song, I wanna listen to it. Like, I hope he like looks at all that, but probably he doesn't. But it's not even like a thing where I'm like, like I like I don't miss him. Anyways, we're gonna change the subject because <laughs> there's just no way to come back from that. Well, we've had our fair share of like, guy troubles and like, emotional paths. Like I've come, especially that dropping out video, like I was crying to her. Like I came in one day from like walking after my yoga class and I listened to the song Sad by, I don't know how to say it, but like XX Tension. Oh yeah, I know who you're talking about. And I was just crying on the floor, like, I don't even know why I'm crying. I know, I, yeah. That was emotional. That was a day. Yeah, I don't know why I was crying like that. Oh well, you got it out of your system. I don't know how I'm gonna do this. Are you doing like eyeshadow and everything? Yeah, I'm doing everything. I wanna use my new product. So this is Too Faced um, Chocolate Matte, but I feel like it's angled enough that, um, oh, what? It's just a lot. I didn't expect that. I like accidentally packed all of my palettes for everything, so I'm using a super like cheap bronzer thing that I use when I'm at the beach. Bro, look, I went crazy. But I was trying something it's okay. new. Yeah, I was trying them new. Like it doesn't look bad. Can you do this? I'm breaking. This. I'm doing like very legal beauty guru things. I left my like laptop and everything Where? at the live, and was like, I'm making a video with my ex. <laughs> Are you gonna go back after this? Yeah. Heck yeah, girl. Get your gun on. I'm pretty sure if like have like the people who watch this like are really good at makeup, they're gonna be like, you guys are bad. But Anne usually looks good. You usually look really good when you do your makeup. No, I feel like we both do. Like we look fine, but when beauty gurus look at the things, they can tell like all the techniques for your dad. You know, I've never really had like a snatch nose. What do you mean? Like you know where you contour your nose. Mm -hmm. I attempted to. Okay, so I've used NARS bronzer and I tried to use a chocolate matte and it just went crazy, but that's what I'm at. Where are you at now? Um, I basically just put like setting powder on my face because oh, it gets cool. kind of oily sometimes. I actually haven't used my. I so I used to try it. So I'm going to go under my eyes where I put concealer. Does that look okay? Yeah, that looks bad. And then you go under it again. Mm -hmm. And that's what you do? Mm -hmm. So is baking when you put that the powder on? Crap. I always feel like baking is when you put like a whole bunch. And then like if you just like kind of use setting powder, I feel like that's just like when you just kind of dust it off. Oh, so this is where you do it. 
Like when you put it like really definite, like definingly mm -hmm. underneath. Yeah. So like, what do you plan on doing this summer? Um, mostly I'm gonna be babysitting because my job is to nanny these super cute, adorable girls. And um, I have a few beach trips planned. Going to Bonnaroo, I'm pretty excited about that. Oh, that's exciting. Oh yeah, I'm really excited. Where is that again? Uh, Manchester, Tennessee. Tennessee? Uh -huh. Whew, that's bizarro. But all my friends went last year and my mom wouldn't let, well my mom and my dad, they wouldn't let me go. Oh, so you're like, I'm old enough to go now. Yeah. I was 18 at the time actually, but they like wouldn't let me go. Cause I, I don't know. Are you upset still? No, I got over it. I was really mad though at the time. Like, we were talking about how our, our families, like, we're all just like them. And I think that's kind of cool. Mm -hmm. I feel like I would be a different parent. Than, like, what your parents did? Yeah, like, don't you always, like, think about your family? I'm going into comedy now. And, like, think about your family and how, like, how you would run things different. Yeah, I, like, think about that. There are some things that, like, I definitely want to do different with my kids, but... When it comes down like to it and like the kind of family that I was raised in, I got like really lucky. Like I have a super great dad and a great mom. And, like they have a really great relationship. Like it's, I mean, like, obviously like, they fight and I've walked in on like some pretty nasty stuff, but wait, I meant like fights, like not like nasty. Yeah, I yeah. got you. Okay. And, but I don't know. I think because like they're so grounded in like their faith and stuff that they just, I'm so thankful for that because yeah. you take your your faith like so far and like wherever your family leaves it definitely like affects you mm -hmm. but I was talking to this one girl um shout out to you Sammy girl we went shopping the other day and um she was talking about how like her dad like doesn't believe he's super scientific and like uh -huh. her boyfriend her ex-boyfriend is how she found um Christ and like I do believe that like you are where you're meant to be oh, and I talk sure. about that all the time and like wherever you are you like God will find you yeah but like just to have that like belief and like the strong support from your family is like really important yeah I definitely think that like if I didn't if I hadn't been raised in like Christian Christianity based household then I think I'd be a very different person and I wouldn't you know be mentally where I'm at yeah like mentally strong yeah but like you always know at the end of the day where yeah where you're meant to be. I feel like okay, I'm using Too Faced blush. I'm using CoverGirl Lash Blast Volume Mascara because I'm out of my better than six. Actually, I was using that just a second ago, but it's basically out and it's super dry. It's kind of gross. I shouldn't use it. Yeah, like replacing your makeup and stuff. I really want to like get good at it. Replacing your makeup or get good at makeup? Get good at makeup and replace makeup. I think you're pretty good at makeup. I, th I thank you. I just need to mix it up. What do you feel like people think about my YouTube? Or like, oh, what did you think about my YouTube? And then tell me what other people think about it. Um, okay, well at first, I was like, oh boy, Gosh. she's a YouTuber. Like, but what do you mean? But like at first, like I like had friends growing up who like got into YouTube. Like I used to make music videos with my friend Catherine all the time, but like never was super like, Ugh. What do you mean? Because I just didn't think that I would like vibe with it. I don't know. Like not that I was like judgmental about it because like I wasn't. I was like, I don't know, it's just different. Like I never really like met anyone else besides the people. Like literally like the girl that like I knew that did YouTube, I grew up with her. Oh. So like it was like different to see someone else who I hadn't grown up with. Um, okay, so I'm now gonna go in with Fenty Beauty Trophy Wife highlight. That's cool. Wait, I wanna see how that looks on you. Like it? Looks like you have a gold spot. Like, like gold. It does. On you. It does look gold. Do you like it? Yeah, I like it a lot. I don't know if you can see it on camera. Um. Okay. Yeah. So keep talking about what you thought about. Um. And what you think other people think. Um. Well, when I first watched it, I was like, oh wait, this is really cool. Like, she's actually really good at this. And then of course, like. I sat and like watched you like make a lot of your videos. I watched you edit them. Oh yeah, you hear so, like, it. That was really cool too, like watching you edit. 
Really? And, yeah, I mean, it was interesting to watch. I thought you sure. were annoyed. No. Like, <laughs> no, I time, feel like you are. It's my face. Like, honestly, like, I have a really bad countenance issue. So. <laughs> what does that mean? Countenance, like, like the way that, face. like, the way that, like, you <clears throat> hold your face. That's a really educated word. Thank word you. My mom day. says it a lot. Because I used to have a really bad problem. She'd be like, you need to fix your countenance. I'd be like. That sounds mean. Well, I mean, it just sounds like mommy, you know, yeah, like it's definitely mommy. Critical, you know. <clears throat> but I don't know, like personally, know anyone else that watches your YouTube. So I don't really know what other people would say. But I feel like if I didn't know you and I like watched it, I would be like, oh, this girl's super like cool, like down to earth, like uh -huh. She's free flowing. Yeah. Hopefully. Yeah, I feel like people think, like, it's something very, like, foreign and, like, different. Mm-hmm. Especially, like, I hate to say it because I'm kind of hating on my own state, but I feel like people from here, they're, like, they would expect, like, oh, only California people do that. Yeah. You know, like, they would never be, like, like, they'll be all about it to watch it, but then, like, the second someone does it, they're, like, what are you doing? Like, yeah. why are you trying to be someone else? Yeah, I Which kind of sucks, but. I love it here, and I could, I don't, I don't know if I could see myself living here, like, after college, but. Like, ever. Possibly. Ever. No. If anything, like, I would move back home, but even then, I don't want to do that. I'd probably move to North Carolina or Nashville, I told you that yesterday. Yeah. I feel like Nashville is cool. I've never been there, but I feel like. You've never been to Nashville? I know. I've been everywhere but Nashville. <laughs> that is so weird. Nashville's so cool. You've been like to Asheville. It. Have you been to Asheville, North Carolina? Mm-hmm. <laughs> love Asheville. I feel like, yeah, we talked about this. I feel like family is a very important part to, like, where you end up and, like, what places you admire. But, like, I grew up in Georgia, but I feel like my end-all, be-all place is California. Mm -hmm. So, like, I feel like you're, you're, you have a special place in your heart for those places. Uh -huh. But at the end of the day, you're going to like where you like, you know? I agree. I think, like... My heart doesn't necessarily, that sounded deep, but like it doesn't like reside in like physical places. I'm a much more like a person who will make someone else her home. We are the same Not like recommend. in how we like people. A very like go all in type of girl. Cause if I don't put every my everything into something, then it's not. <sighs> this is like deep, but I don't feel like how y you can just not give your all like at some, like some, yeah. you know, like why not say it? I understand like having some people like you don't, I don't know. There have been times where I've trusted people and I was like, why did I do that? Okay, I can totally, you know what person I'm talking about. Yeah. But at the end of the day, like, most of the time it's not going to be a regret because... That's true. Out of all the people, I've been like, you know, like we had like such a great relationship and then I was like, oh wait, never mind, I snapped right him first. Um, I've been like, I wish I would have never met them. Like, after a while, I've been like, that was such a great growth experience. Like, I feel like even... In high school, I wanted to appease guys. Yeah. And like now looking back, I'm like, oh, I'm so much stronger. I feel like this year especially, it's given me more like, like I have the confidence to be like, you, we, me and you both know what I deserve. So like, what's the deal? Mm. Most guys don't, I feel like they don't care what you want. Yeah, or like maybe they're just like so caught up in themselves that they don't even realize that they don't care and they just, you know, do. I don't understand guys. Like, I feel like we both don't understand guys sometimes, you know? I want to understand. I actually really like how this eye turned out. I'm gonna go in with this chrome paint top yacht. Oh, I thought you were gonna take that back. I was, but I feel like it's still the product, you know? Mm -hmm. And I don't have time. I do like the way that that turned out. Right? Mm -hmm. it looks good. It's, it's very, like it's very um, pigmented. It's hard for me to wear like really like orangey brassy colors like that. Oh yeah. I'm so pale. I think I kinda screwed it up, but let me see. That oh, looks good. Thanks, Aggie. <laughs> Are you almost done? I would do more, but I've literally packed up all of my stuff. Are you done? Pretty much, yeah. Besides sash spray. Okay, let me just do one more thing to my eyes. What's like something that you would want everyone to know about you that you feel like no one knows. I can't even handle my own problems. 
Like, I can't even understand what's going like, on in give my me own a head. Beat, like, yeah, just give me, like, a second to catch my breath and, like... But it always... It happens at the worst times, too. I always want to help people, so I, I... Honestly, like, it makes me feel bad. I was like... I'll sit there and feel bad at the fact that, like, I don't want to talk to this person, but it's not because they did anything wrong. It's just because I literally can't get my head together. I totally get that. Like, but people just don't understand that sometimes it, like, feeds you to be by yourself, you know? Mm -hmm. Especially, like, emotionally and mentally. Are you done? I'm done. We have setting spray. Okay. Okay, last step together. <laughs> wow. Honestly, I don't think they've ever looked better. Yay. What do we do? I don't know, just laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for watching this video. Um, I love talking <laughs> with Maggie. I know it was kind of like sporadic, but like that's just like who we are. Um, but I do love how our makeup turned out. I always see her at different times of makeup. We never like do it together. So that was fun. So if you liked this video, please give it a big thumbs up. And also head down to my channel, maybe subscribe, check it out. <laughs> I guess that is it. I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you in the next one. Bye. Bye. <laughs>